Good morning, my fellow Nords. It's another Skyrim Mods coffee review. I am Gijara. I'm Rismilo7. And today we are going to be looking at the Medusa and Dracul armor created by Zero Frost and ported by X Danny Kitty 915X. Um, this is a fairly recent mod created. It's a featured mod, too. And it's also a featured, yes. But it was created in April of this year. No. Uh, it also says you can do that a forge if you have the Dwarven for the Medusa and the Daedric for the Dracul. Yes. Keep northeast. I am. Now, yes. while you can forge it, they do say that there's a chest. Where? Northeast of Kinst uh, Kinstag. Is that the name of it? Okay, but you said... All right, you said it was the key was on a spider. Yes. So is the chest on around the spider too? I'm kind of hoping so because <sighs> I don't mind killing big ass critters or anything, but to hunt for a spider, really, in this spider infested place, well, there's three. They're gone. They're there again. Fine, we'll do it this way. You see me? Yes, no? A spider. Okay. Three of them. Well, that's thin, no? Okay. So these are... Athena. There is. Now, where's the freaking chest? Well, that's the next step. Why do you name this one? You're a lay. Okay. Well, my guess is if they were here... Then the chest is right here. Okay. Helmet. Um. Yeah, go back up to Dracul armor. Really? All right, and the faces again. The helmets. Well, I like Medusa's um, helmet. You like Dracul's or Medusa's? Medusa's. I like Dracul's. Medusa's armor. Dracul gauntlets. Okay, cool. It's heavy armor, too. This was... Um, yeah, it is. It's all heavy armor. Darn. Okay. Okay. Um, I think what I'm going to do is just head on back to... Before we try any of this on. I got to find somebody to try on the Medusa armor. I'll try it on myself, but I don't know if it'll... If it's um, created for a man's... Go get Sophia. Sophie, Sophia, whichever one. And White Run. Yeah. Mm. You could have done that on mine and then get got Lucy in her... Lucy to try on the Dracul. Watch out. 
coming up to white run on this road. She does have a marker. Yeah, I know, so but she's not that hard to find. It's not a matter of hard to find. It's a matter of crashing the desktop. For some reason, on that road, you just crashed to this all. This works better. Yeah, just sit there and look at her. Got the fleetest steeds in all the sky room. What is it? What? Where am I? Sorry, we have to go through this now. Yeah. Oh, it's you. I mean, what? No, I've never seen you before. I have no idea who you are. It's not like I've been stalking you or anything. Um, okay. I have to go Wait. now. Wait! Don't leave! I, I'm injured! Uh, yes, injured. You have to take me with you. Otherwise, I might die, and you wouldn't want that on your conscience. Now, you look alright to me? Yeah, well, that's because... Okay, fine. If you take me with you, I will make it worth your while. You won't hey. find anyone tougher than me in Skyrim. Nico. No. Not to mention it's Sorry, he's about to attack my other cat. No, no, no. Come on. I suppose I could use some backup. Is that it? Nico. Aren't you going to flex your muscles Sorry, and tell me how great you are? Sorry, I just make a little noise to get his attention sometimes. That seems to be the customary Nico. greeting in Skyrim. Anyway, <laughs> there's no suppose about it. Everyone can use someone a little he's more like me. Persistent. Okay, so why were you... What happened to your clothes? What? I do like the fact I've, that if no you idea. do, if you don't have, if you've got her, is a little fuzzy. um, if you basically have installed, any, but you don't have it gotten her during the war, oh, and she fights her way. I mean, you get up there, yeah. never seen and you come out here, and she's fighting away, killing uh, Star Cloak, so, you know, I think it's pretty cool. I don't know. I'll just go wherever you are going. I will repay your kindness by fighting alongside no, you. No, you can give her the armor. Surely that's an offer you can't refuse. Let's not hang around. Oh, I haven't introduced myself, have I? My name is Sophia, but you probably already knew that. I'm quite well known in Skyrim, although sometimes I'm not sure if it's for the right reasons. I kind of see myself as an adventurer. Although it's no fun without anyone to witness my heroic deeds, such as... Well, I'm sure there's probably something. I like to get drunk, kill stuff, and be a nuisance. So, what about you? Yeah, yeah. Nice to meet you. I hope to be of some use to you. I'm rather talented if I say so myself, so I'm sure there must be something I can do for you. Just let me know. Let me guess. You want to talk? Um, can I? Didn't you get her to follow you, right? Back off. Oh, uh, okay, but you did get her to you follow say you? So. Yeah. Okay. Oh, goodness, I'm going to be overweight when I put on. Yeah, so you don't put it on until you get to the, 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 the back to the Lonely Manor? Okay, let's see. X door. She's not wearing it. She's not wearing it. I gotta find someone else. So, can you get her out of the freaking barn first? Let's not hang around then. Got to flee the speeds and all the sky room. Can you sing? I would. I have something for you. Try that one. I'd oh, get her the heck out of the stables it? first. Okay. Yeah, see, she's not putting it on. It's heavy armor, oh. so she won't. I don't know. I just don't know. Fine, but don't take advantage of me. At least not in that way. Can you? Yeah, she won't wear it. I understand that, but can you get her the hell out of here? Okay. And try it that I'm way, here. just if Did you're going to try it at all, always. Get her that out of the stable. Man like you need okay. more <gasps> Jeez. Finally. I never thought I would be so happy to 
go and see the Greybeards? But after having to tag along with the Mavens, using just one hand for your weapon? I always thought you had good wrist action. But then again, most men do. If you say so. There she goes. If you say so. Okay. Give her that. Gauntlets. And a helmet. Yes. Just get back out. There. Thank I'm you. I'm here. If you ever need me. That's just... Back, back up. No. Yeah, um. Looks like samurai armor. Stay there. She's not gonna. Tell her to wait there. <clears throat> What's on your mind? Don't you dare forget and leave me here. Otherwise, I'm gone. I just don't like full armor. I mean, heavy well, armor. And no. It may. Shock, look out. This idiot is upset about something. What idiot? I don't know. Is there something you wanted? Hold on to these, please. Um, I need to trade. Yeah. Trade things with her. To hump all these stupid objects just to please you. I mean, hump as in carrying stuff, by the way, not the kind before your dirty mind gets any ideas. Okay, we're going to take those back from her. Good idea. That's her sword. Okay, but don't push your luck. What was it, iron? Who the heck knows? Steel? Steel. Must be because I don't have... There's a steel sword. Okay. Yes, let's go. Let's go inside and put this on a mannequin. Mm -hmm. Maybe that'd be better. It's gonna be worse. It's okay. It'd be okay on a mannequin, but... It just looks... Heavy and it yeah. looks heavy. I mean, it looks. I mean, it's cool. You know, it's a it's a neat armor. It's just not not. Uh, -uh. I don't like dwarven and I don't like <laughs> heavy. So that's two things. Well, there is one thing about the mask that I noticed, or at least with Medusa's. Yeah. If anybody has seen Transformers The Last Night, the face looks kind of like Quintessa. It does. That's who it reminded me of. I knew it reminded me of something. That's who it reminded me of. <coughs> okay. Find your mannequin. You didn't free. Please. He's in such a hurry with this thing. Okay. Jeez. Okay, let's do it this way, cause this one will be cool. No, are you gonna put Drake hole? Well, that's a wide-hipped thing. In the. 
I don't like that. I just don't like that. And I don't know. <laughs> no, see? Can't do that. That comes straight up dwarven. Oh man. Well that stinks. That's just terrible. Oh, I'm back over Let's there. Give you some room. Jeez. Yeah, do put the put put this on, please. Do I? Put it on. You. Okay. And take off your cloak and that um, bow and arrow. Where's my cloak? Down. Yeah, I'd be under fur. Okay. And then your the bow. Okay. Yeah. Now just stand there. Um, a little funky. Those spikes on his shoulder, on his elbows. You're gonna stab anybody behind him. Yep. And they'll hurt. Get rid of your shield. And your sword. No. Yeah, shield there. And. Really? Get rid of my sword? Yes. There. I think the colors look really good on it. it I, I do too. It's just that the um, mm, the pointy in the front is not so much. Hatch. That. 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 Well, let me give you a bear hug. Well, yeah, that's what I'm saying. But and the things in the are a little bit long or something rather. Yeah. Or especially if you got followers. <laughs> And don't do we don't do helmets just because you know work on the helmet and yeah we don't do helmets because we work so hard on our face you know well yeah to get to where we like it I want oh it look matches with the with your um my test war my paint. war paint yeah I don't know like I said I don't like heavy armor so much and I hate that part in the front right there. And the chest is like pointy. It. I like it. <laughs> I mean, if I were doing heavy armor, yeah, this would be it. Oh, if I if I was doing heavy armor, basically, yes, I, this would be cool. Unfortunately, you can't wear this. You'd have to wear Medusa's. Now, put on Medusa's, see what it does to you. I want to see what it does with you. Oh, I already know what it's going to do. Well, if it goes back to... Okay. Yeah. Go straight back like like the other one does to me. Went yeah. Straight back to Dark Brotherhood. Just go straight to Dwarven. Okay. Okay. Well, we have an idea that'll help this out, but give what? us a second. You want to put yours back on? Yeah, I guess I do. <laughs> yes. Gauntlets, shield. And I want to take Dracula's helmet off. Yeah. Okay. Okay. You're going to do so, what I think you're going to do? I'm going to stop and I'm going to come back on as you. Well, you're going to have to go get the spider then. Nope. You, one of your characters is fully cheated and has all the perks. I don't have all some of but yeah. She should. She should. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a quick break. And we're going to come back as Miss Milo's character, but she's not going to kill the spider. We're just going to she's going to be to fully cheated. She's going to smith it. She's going to smith it. But we want to get a good look at this. 
So we'll be right back. Okay, as promised, we are back. Um, we did find out that there was a slight issue with the mod. Nothing major, it just makes the crafting a bit difficult. Because when you look at the armor... The image of the armor covers everything, so you can't see what you need. Yeah, it's a little low, so it, it covers all the, the, the ingredients. Um, yeah. Dwarven. We got all the Dwarven metal ingots. You do need frostbite, frostbite venom, not the potion. You know, it's the frostbite venom. Yes. I guess the four that you get from, or the whichever you get from the um, spiders you kill may be enough to do it. But, I mean, I got four, so. Yeah. We're going to yeah. see. Steel ingots and a daedra heart. Yeah. Okay. Leather strips. But, yeah, we went ahead and killed the spiders and got the armor again, so. So what he's going to do is go up and get the other stuff he needs. Well, no, because I have it now. I don't need to craft okay. it. Okay. That's right. I keep forgetting that. Yeah. He's already I have it now. I don't need to craft yeah. it. <clears throat> anyway, so. if you don't want to go look for all that stuff, go grab it. Yes. Okay. Armor. Um, all this. Helmet. Okay. Let's see. And there we go. Yeah, see, it looks like Quintessa. It really does. I also like the snake head on the right <laughs> shoulder. Look at that. Yeah, the snake's coming out of the helmet itself. I just... It is cool armor. I just... I don't like dwarven. This one does look parts. a bit more dwarven than the Dracul. Yes, and... I'm not real. See, see it. What does it? What it does if she tries on the the cool Dracul? Go straight to Daedric. Yes. Straight to Daedric. Okay. So it is gender specific armor. Yeah. So that's pretty cool. That, that you know, and that's not a big deal. I think that's no. actually quite. It is. I mean. I, I prefer the dark of the Dracul, and because I've never been fond of dwarven armor, it looks cool. But I would never wear the helmet at all, um, because I like their face. Well, let's take the helmet off and see how she looks without the helmet. Looks better. It's still heavy though. No, it's going to look heavy. It's what it is. Yeah. Let's see. And then down here around the waist, the little snake looking thing. The snake belt. Yeah. Yeah. It's cool. Can you get to her full body thing or anything? That's about as close as I could get without. Okay. Can you put her in third person at all? This is third person. Really? Yes. Well, that just sucks. What if she has to fight? What if she's walking around? Huh? Huh? That's where you are. Okay, you're gonna walk her? And... Let's see. That's awful slow. Well, I'm carrying too much to do any running. Well, this is true. I do like that snake head, though, but... Yeah, she doesn't do... Cool yeah, question. neither of our characters are heavy armor characters, so. Yeah, so, I mean. You yeah. know, it would. And maybe if we had the female mannequin mod. Yeah, but I, but I do would love to have some really, really good um, dark armor for her, but it's got to be a light armor. Right now, yeah. I'm just using the True Nightingale because I don't have anything else. Yes. But I do like. I love that little snake head thing on the side. Yes. This is this is one of those mods where having the extra mod for female mannequins would look real good because you could actually put this on that. Uh, unfortunately, we don't have that, so we can't <laughs> display this anywhere. It's either you wear it, or you don't, or you put it away. <laughs> you know, and that really sucks. But other than that, it's it's a cool armor and. 
I just like I just we don't uh, my character should don't wear helmets. No. Of course, she's fully cheated. Nobody's gonna hurt her, hit her, nor on the head anyway. So. Okay. I do like it. All in all, it's a really cool looking armor. I love it. It is a male and female for the Dracul. Uh, yeah. If you do it on different um, genders, it's going to revert right yes. back to type. <clears throat> so. I mean, so I would, I, I would, I would, I, I love the Dracul, you know, and can't wear it. Yeah. It's happened a couple times. There's a, there's armors that I really love that to look at, but I can't wear it because it reverts back to either ebony or whatever it was. Yeah. It was intended for in the first place. And this one goes back to Daedric. Daedric to me is, is heavy armor. I don't like it. <laughs> you know, so. Okay. Okay. So anyways, guys. This was the Medusa and Dracul armor created by Zero Frost, ported by Danny Kitty 915. Yeah, it's specific for male. Well, yes. One for male, one for female. And go kill the spiders because if you want to craft them, it's going it, to be difficult to see the, that. You're, well, you're going to need frostbite venom. And we're cheated and we got all yeah. every single kind of ingots and everything else. But I don't think we have frostbite venom. Of course, I keep all sorts of crap so well anyway. we'll have to check that out but in any case this is a skyrim mods coffee review i am gajara i'm miss milo seven be sure to hit the like follow subscribe button we got videos coming almost every day uh miss milo is going to share this too my facebook to three groups the skyrim mods and modders uh skyrim junkies and to the lowercase of the skyrim addicts so if you happen to be on facebook check out those groups they have lots of good topics, screenshots, and they're fun to tips, read. fun to read. And of course, if you come across one of these videos, give her a like, thank give you, her a comment, you. let her know you're watching. Yes. And we will see you with our next review.